it takes 17 yeses to erase that one no. So on the same token, for one negative comment that you get in your life, it takes 17 positive comments or praises for you to actually let go of that one negative comment. So it is words. Words are so powerful, um, whether they are used for good or for Unfortunately, a lot of times in society, they are used to hurt people. And um, I certainly think that if we can kind of arm ourselves and become better at pivoting um, and, you know, not add to that insult already, then in the long run, we can all work to make situations better, not just for ourselves, but also for our family members, our friends and our colleagues, you know, and we can really change the environment and um, change, you know, for the good. So I wanted to just recap that, you know, uh, the importance of seeing words um, and how they are a gift. They can be a, a really amazing gift to us human beings um, because it allows us to use it as a form of language um, and connection. Um, it also um, allows us to express ourselves in terms of um, eliciting different types of emotions. And it also gives us our thoughts, you know, so in terms of thoughts, um, affirmations are a very, very uh, useful and powerful uh, part of um, a tool that we can use our words for. And if we can let go of certain words such as can't and but, and instead replace them with how can I and it's possible, I certainly hope that it will change some of, you know, the, the, the things that you do in your life and, and the, the trajectory of, you know, where you're heading as much as it has changed mine. All right, Healthy Wisdomers, it has been another pleasure sharing this episode, and I hope you had as much fun as I did sharing it with you. Um, I'd like to thank you all for listening as always. Um, please take a minute to subscribe, follow, and rate this episode so we can share all our wisdom with everyone else that we know. And also, let's invite them to join us on this journey. This is the Healthy Wisdom Series with Dr. Jen Chen. I'll see you guys next week.